I heard a little portion of this podcast the other day that I thought was really interesting. If Have you ever heard of the term Saved by the Bell? I thought it was fascinating. Uh, first thing I thought when I heard the guy ask the question was like, oh yeah, Saved by the Bell, the school. You know, I, w- I was born in 1980, so I, I got an idea of uh, Saved by the Bell, the show. And then I, I started to think after, uh, I think it was Gringo who said, Oh, saved by the bell, you know, you're you're getting beat up in the boxing ring and the bell rings and you're saved, but this guy was saying that the term saved by the bell actually came from a time when there was a plague on the earth and the plague was kind of a weird um, virus that attacked your heart and uh, so it would leave patients uh, with this really, really low heartbeat to where you couldn't even tell if they were alive, but it was just enough for them to be alive and what they were doing is they were burying people alive basically and uh, these grave robbers ended up finding people were trying to claw their way out of the caskets you know if they knew that they were uh, wealthy or whatever they would dig up their grave and see if they had rings or gold or jewelry or anything treasure and uh, yeah they found that some of these people had died in the casket um, trying to claw their way out and so what they did is they came up with this idea and I'm not sure if that's the main reason why they did it but they put this little channel down into the into the casket and with a string and sticking out of the ground there was a bell and so you would ring the bell and you would be saved by the bell basically they would come and dig you up if if you were in there ring the bell uh, and then they had this uh, the term graveyard shift and the graveyard shift was the guy that had to sit in the graveyard and listen for the bells at night. It was pretty crazy.